Happy mid-October from the Hickory Grove Garden Dome. We are transitioning in here from summer crops to fall crops. I, I've already planted a bunch of seeds. I've got spinach and lettuce and kale and things going. All the herbs are still in here. I'm still fighting white flies, um, but I'm going to bring some ladybugs in this week, so maybe they'll help out. I don't know. Um, I've got lots of ginger over here that I think I should probably harvest a little bit of so it doesn't overcrowd the pots. Um, there's one plant back there, this nice tall ginger, and then I've got the shorter ginger over here. Um, I just cut back but my cantaloupe is still going. So we'll see if any of these little babies continue to, to progress to cantaloupe. We've pulled a few nice sort of personal sized cantaloupes off of here. This seems to be doing okay. I um, started some carrots some salad greens. We've got a tomato here that I've cut back. Kale. Some onions. Some more spinach. Nasturtiums, of course. Lemon verbena is still going. This artichoke, which I thought was dead, came back. So maybe it likes it not to be too hot. So it's growing. And I brought one of my cherapitas in from the garden after spraying it well. Not that it matters, there's tons of bugs in here. Um, serrano pepper, I'll, I'll get rid of once it's done producing fruit. The oregano back there seems to have finally taken off, so that's good. Um, yesterday it was sunny out, it was about 90 in here, and then it dropped down to about 56 last night. It was right around 40 outside, so I mean, I think that's that's a good balance. Um, I'm not sure how it's going to do on its own, so I am installing a propane heater just in case for when the temperatures really drop low. Um, this thing you see here is a tree colored that grew in the garden this year, and I, I cut it back, and it's just coming back from... In the base there. So some more cabbages, kale. This is a poblano pepper here. Um, I don't know if it's going to produce any fruit. It's just now flowering, so we'll see. Um, some basil that came up by itself. I have this um, crazy cherry tomato in here that I just cut back, but I'll have to cut it back again, I'm sure because it's kind of going crazy. I may take it out because it, it's in a spot where it's just not very good for trying to get through here. Um, my figs finally started to produce. So I have this one very tall branch and it's got some figs on it. So let's see how that does. Um, we have the cucumber. This is a greenhouse cucumber um, specifically designed that doesn't need to be fertilized I guess so it, it makes these nice long English cucumbers and there's quite a few still coming on the plant so I've cut it back and it had a resurgence after I cut it back from the summer heat it does have some sort of pest on it on the leaves. I think they might be spider mites, but i um, not really sure what's going on here. However, it seems to be doing okay. Um, I just started some lemongrass, so we'll see how that does. I have it in here next to the citrus plants and the geraniums in the center bed. It's sort of my tropical area over here. And still herbs, uh, Thai chili, 
My Christmas cactus has decided it's going to be probably a Halloween cactus or a Thanksgiving cactus. It's alright. A little bit of lettuce hiding over here with my lemon balm. I did put a grapevine in here a month and a half ago, so that's doing pretty well. We'll see how it does through the winter and you know, maybe we'll have some nice grapes. They're seedless grapes, so I'm done with seeded grapes. It's too much work. So everything else seems to be doing pretty well. I just wanted to give you a nice update. I brought a couple peppers in from the garden. I've got um, another Serrano and a Lilac Bell sweet pepper that just came back to life after maybe being too hot or crowded in the garden, so it's um, been flowering and at least we're still getting honeybees in here, so I, I'm guessing that it'll get pollinated enough to throw a few more fruit. That'd be good. That's it for today, folks. Have a great afternoon.